Have you had an NPC die on you, one that was maybe even a quest giver or somebody who's important to a quest, and now that they're dead, you don't know what to do? There is a way to revive them in this game and bring them back. Now you should notice in most of the main like towns, for example, like Vernworth over here, Vernworth actually has a, a charnel house. This is where they keep the dead. They keep the bodies. They put the bodies in here. This is the place you got to go to. You access it from this location from in the town. You just go through the stairs down into the stairs here. If I show you what this looks like from this perspective, we're basically going to go run down this pathway over here. And you'll see this is what it looks like. This is the entrance. And you're going to run down the stairs, run inside. You'll see there's a guy over here who you're going to speak to. For the very first time you speak to him, he's going to want 5,000 gold to look for bodies, right? So he's going to basically look for a body. And this will list everybody in your game, an NPC who's dead. Maybe they died adventuring. Maybe they, you know, you killed them. I don't know. Like, you know, maybe they're just dead. I don't know. If we go ahead and we select this guy, for example, we can go light a candle to mark his coffin so that we know which coffin is his because otherwise you're not going to know who you're reviving. And you're going to go down the stairs and you're quite simply just going to go look for the coffin. Now you can see here this room doesn't have any coffins. There's only one coffin here. So it's kind of like obvious who's the dead guy. But you don't know who it is unless you like speak to that guy and pay the gold. So from here, you can actually examine and you'll be given the option to confirm and another option to use a wake stone to revive him. Now, wake stones are very rare kind of items. I only have two of them at this point, and I feel like I'm like near halfway through the game. So this is not something you should waste, but you can get more of it when you get three wake stone shards, which is something you'll find often and sometimes in chests and as rewards. When you combine three of these together, it actually turns into a wake stone. Like it just, it just converts three into one wake stone. So you can get wake stones. It's not impossible. There's probably ways to grind it. I just don't know yet. And you can use the wake stone at this location. I'll, I'll, just, I'll just use it to demonstrate. So if I go ahead and I revive him, this is what it looks like to achievements. I just got two achievements. Great. And now he's awake. And if that was somebody you needed for a quest, they're, they're alive now. So that's how you solve that. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and thanks for watching.